What's up, everybody? Welcome back to some Squad Builder Showdown. Today, we are doing it on Fantasy FC hero, Paolo Futre. A man whose cards cost one million coins. A man who's got five-star skills, only three-star weak foot, but now actually has functional shooting stats because I've packed both of his versions, I think, on my road to glory, Jack. And he just can't finish his dinner. Mm. But his dribbling's insane. Yeah. And now... Hopefully he can. Yeah, I've used this guy a couple of times now, and he is quite frankly the best dribbler I've used on this game. Uh, simple as that. Really? Mate. Yeah, he's in. Wow. Absolutely mental. Absolutely mental. And I can confirm he can shoot now, mate. He can shoot. Although the three-star weak foot is a bit, you know, come on. I'm willing to look past the three-star weak foot yeah. if he is the best dribbler on this game. Mm -hmm. True, true. And now that he can finish as well... Everything's looking good. With a hunter on him, he has 99 pace as well. This card looks mental, Jack, and it costs a million coins. And you know what? 900k. I think that's pretty reasonable. I think that's a fair enough cost for this card. He is represented by Atletico, which you would hope... I mean, 11 goals is quite... A, yeah, he's set a big target mm -hmm. with 11 goals. Yeah. For all of the cards. But you'd think he's going to get an upgrade and go to 91. I mean, you would think so. I'm just looking at seeing where Atletico Madrid are actually in the table. They are fourth, mate. So, they're, I mean, they're they probably are. underperforming for maybe what they would have expected maybe this year. I don't know. But they're scoring goals. They've got 52 goals this year. So, that's only five or three less than Girona, who have the most in the league. So... Not too bad, mate. That is a crazy stat, yeah. isn't it? They're, that's like the Leicester City, isn't it, really? Of the La Liga. Girona. Where were they last season? I don't even know, mate. Who even are they? <laughs> Where even is Girona? Is it even in Spain? <laughs> <laughs> I can tell you, actually. Let me go pop up and take it back to last year. Last year, Girona finished 10th. Yeah. And they had barely half the points of Barcelona who won the league. Mm -hmm. It's ma madness. Absolute madness. But fair play to them, Wait mate. a second. Hang on. Two seasons ago, they were in the second division. <laughs> oh, that can't be. Oh, my God. And and they finished sixth. And they got into the playoffs on head-to-head -head with Real Oviedo. Is this real? So they were scraped by the skin of their teeth into the playoffs. Got promoted, finished 10th in actual La Liga, and then this season they are second? They, uh, they, they've say. got... Oh, wait, hang on. Are Girona the ones that are like Man City C? Um, That's them, isn't it? With that Savio. And yeah, Savio me... is the one where um, he's like signed for City, hasn't he? For like... Or for, from yeah, like yeah, next yeah, season Girona, for like 50 I'm looking million. Off, off. Yeah, he, he's actually on loan from a club that City own in France, <laughs> the Troyes, and they loaned him to another club that City own in Spain. He's never <laughs> played for Troyes despite being their record signing, yeah. and he's now signed for City. Tell me that's How do you, not That dodgy. is just, uh, it's just corruption in it, let's be honest with you. We have gone off on one already when this is about Paolo through Trey Jack. <laughs> How do you sign? Imagine, who's Liverpool's record signing, Jack? Uh, my God. Is it Van Dyke? Is it Van Dyke? I think it's Van Dyke. I feel like Everton's a Sigurdsson, you know. Yeah, because Nunes was less. Nunes was at 63. Well, who, who have you bought recently? Is it Darwin Nunes? I mean, Dominic Soberslai was like 70 mil. All right, imagine buying Soberslai and then immediately loaning him to Utrecht. I mean, yeah, it's madness. He never plays a game for Liverpool. Yeah. And then you sell him to Real Madrid. Yeah. <sighs> I mean, I, I understand if it was a player, a, a team that was not under the parenthood of City. No, but you, no, because you never, ever, 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 ever buy your record signing and then immediately loan them out. Yeah, it, it's mental. It's mental. That is insane. I suppose that, yeah, their argument is that he's better. He's not going to be playing, is he? So because of his age maybe and they've got a very I mean City are you know arguably the best team in the world so but the thing that does me is the fact that it's their parent club or the club that's owned by whoever owns them it, that's a bit dodgy in my opinion it's not a bit dodgy it's very 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 dodgy very very dodgy have you also seen actually sorry on the City note have you seen City have the most followers of any Premier League club on Instagram do they? yeah 
Oh, I guess the. Tell me you bought followers without telling me you bought followers. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, that is. Nah, come on. But they've got. You've like got to 50, give credit where it's due, Jack. Got, Man City social media is class. Yeah, but they've got. Man City were their first million. team to properly make a YouTube channel. Yeah, to yeah, yeah. properly hire players for esports. Everything that is like at the forefront of new age social media football, all that sort of stuff. Say what you want about corruption and fake sponsors and buying multiple clubs and loaning your players to yourself and all that sort of stuff, but. Credit where credit's due. Their social media game and their move into the modern age of football, they've absolutely smashed it. Yeah, and they oh, are yeah. like the the team to... So, for, like, for example, so a few years ago, I swear Man United didn't even have a women's team. I don't know, to be honest. I'm pretty sure that's true. Liverpool's was in the second division, whereas City pumped crap loads of money into women's football. They've pumped crap loads of money into developing their social media and all stuff like that. I, as much as I like to criticise them, or do they, not that I like to criticise them, as much as they deserve the criticism, and we like to just waffle, i got to give credit where it's due. Their social media game stuff is insane. Mm -hmm. No, I agree. I agree. I did see you tweet now, though, 50 million followers and can't fill their stadium. <laughs> well, thought that was pretty funny, to be fair. <laughs> but, to be, but then also, isn't that just fake news? Don't City sell out every week? No. No? No. If you look at the stadium, there are so many... Not to pun it, but you know, there is a load of empty But they're seats. building a new stand to add like 8,000 more seats. Surely they wouldn't do that if they couldn't sell out what they've currently got. I swear they sell out every week. No, they don't. They don't. Look at, if you just, just look at a, I can't remember, it was a game recently and there is so many empty seats on, I can't remember what it was. I mean, it, this was from Twitter, so don't get me wrong. Like, I didn't see this from my personal eyes, but uh, it could have been footage from, you know, where they've made it look like um, that, but when criticism is like fair, I will always give it. But we can't be spreading fake news and fake stats. The capacity of the Etihad is fifty-three thousand four hundred. The average attendance this season for Man City is fifty-three thousand two hundred and eighty-two. Yeah, but so on average, there's a hundred and eighteen seats that somebody hasn't filled. Yeah, but have you seen? like the actual stadium. They might have sold them, but is there are there people there? I don't know. I don't know. I'm not the I'm, I'm, I'm not the only one, mate. I don't know. I, I, but yeah, I don't know. For, uh, for contrast, Anfield, 53,852 average attendance. Anfield's got 61,000 seats, Jack. No comment. As with EA and all the ridiculous stuff on the market, I will happily slag them off when they deserve it, but you've got to at least come at me with the facts. We've been waffling a lot, Jack. Pick a formation. I would like the 4-3-3 second, please, mate. You may have it. Is that because, like, 7,000 of Liverpool's seats have only just opened when I went to the derby after the stand was closed? Oh, uh, I don't know, to be honest. I assume Probably. so, maybe. Potentially. Because then that would drag the average for the season down, wouldn't it? Because you could get in them seats. Yeah, I mean, uh, it's tough to get a Liverpool ticket, put it that way. All I'm saying is I think the empty had thing is a meme now. I don't think it's actually true. They might all be tourists and it mightn't be like super hardcore ultras or whatever, but yeah. I think it is full. It's the same as Arsenal. Like, Arsenal Stadium's always full. Mm-hmm. But I've been to the Etihad for an Arsenal game, and it's it's not exactly a bouncing, you know. Yeah. But it's the same. It's the same as Anfield. Like Anfield's full of tourists as well. I've been to Anfield for the game. I've, I've to be fair, I've sat in the cop for the derby once, and that was bouncing because it's the cop. But if you go and sit in the main stand or something, it's just people taking pictures and stuff. Mm -hmm. And then they go to the Beatles tour on the docks, you know. <laughs> it's just the way football is, isn't it? Yeah. So, no. Very true. Very true. Anyway. Anyway. Well, there you've done. Considering we sat here for about an hour trying to decide who to do this video on because the market is mental. <laughs> We've had a lot to talk about, actually, Jack. It doesn't really matter who the player is. <laughs> I'm going to have 3 4 2 1. You're free at the back end. Okay. Fair I'm free play, at the mate. back end, mate. I was not expecting that. Fair yeah. play, mate. I put down 4 2 1 3. So did I. It's the new formation, mate. Where on the street is it's the new Jack 54 special? It, it is the new Jack 54 HD special. Should we get into the first picks? Let's do it. 
right, Jack, we've had a lot of chitty chatting. We've both got our formations. Maybe there'll be a waffle skipper on this video and people can just jump straight <laughs> to this point. Hello. I do love a good chit chat, but not everyone wants to listen to it. Do you want to see me guess your players, Jack? Indeed, which you won't be doing today, mate, unfortunately. Go on, who do you want? Okay, so on the left-hand side, mate, we're going to go for a rather expensive SBC player, and it is going to be Timo Werner. Wait, uh, uh, what? Yeah. He can play left wing. He can play left wing, mate, and... Uh, Shut up, he's, he's got, so good. He's got 95 pace, mate. Um, he's... And then, through the middle, we're going to have Diogo Jota. That's so, so, so bait, Jack. Oh, you're so annoying. That Werner card, there's just something about him that just makes him good. And I, don't, I still don't understand what it is. And Richarlison's injured, so J Werner's going to play. And he, to say he's going to score is probably a bit of an exaggeration, but he might do. <laughs> he might get an upgrade, you know? Crazy. And then that Jota's so bait. Which is why I wrote it down. Hmm, hmm, hmm. <laughs> no striker for you, Jack. <sighs> We're off to a good start. Fantastic. Hmm. I was going to go. Who was your other player? Rafael Leal. I, I, I was going to go for Richarlison, but I, the only upgraded card he has is a chem breaker, and I, I can't waste my. My extra chem break. Can't waste your chem break on Richie. Oh, oh. But now I've got bronze, so, you know, works well then, doesn't it? Would you like yourself? Yes, I will. Yeah, I will, actually. Nice. I don't know if I ever told this story, actually, on Scorpio Shadow. Maybe we did. Kira and Slicker. Slicks. Really nice guy in real life. We filmed a footy video with FG with him, and then went, like, went out for lunch and stuff. He's proper sound. But apparently you watched the Scorpio the Shadow, and you gave me him. And then I absolutely cooked you with him. <laughs> I think I remember. <laughs> and then he, he messaged me afterwards. So he, he watched the video and messaged me saying, I best not ever be a trump card ever again yeah. after that performance. I'm, I'm pretty sure you banged in a goal with him. You 100% did, actually. So you have replaced them, mate. There you go. You uh, can have the cruise. Thank you very much. I, Jack, I'm going to go for the greatest Portuguese player the Premier League has ever seen. And Cristiano Ronaldo. Bait. <laughs> Did you like that one? That's real bait. So I'll also have Jota and I'll have Cristiano Ronaldo, please, Jack. You're a joke. You're a joke. You're a joke. No, 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 no. How the turns have tabled, my friend. I'd be down Griezmann and Correa. Yes! Suck it, Jack. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so annoyed. I hadn't even completed the Jota SBC, and I was prepared to do it for this video just so that I could beat you with him. Well, I have completed it, and he's going in my squad. No. Very nice. Very nice. I don't like this. Should we move on to the centre mids? Yes, let's do it. All right, Jack. Into the midfield we go. Mm-hmm. I've just found... A lovely sneaky player in my club. Hopefully you think I don't have this. Moment Ruben Neves. Very bait though. Very, very bait. And then to go next to him, Renato Sanchez. Oh, that sounds like violence. That sounds good. Is that you smashing your whiteboard? Oh no, he's clapping. Well oh no, he's clapping. Oh well no, he's clapping. Well done, Andy. It took you two rounds for me to guess a player. Now, that Ruben Nevers, mate, wasn't so sneaky after all, was he? Get him the, side, you getting? the hell oh. out of there. I was doing it and I was thinking it's so bait, I'm going to get away with it again like Jota. <laughs> Come on. <sighs> Who else did you put? DePaul, mate. Because I'm not. Shut up. Yeah. I could have had Bruno Fernandes. I mean, my original thing was Ruben Nevers and Bruno, uh, Bruno Fernandes, but you got a bit of La Liga in there, haven't you? you the hero. So I thought, uh, I'd give it a little well. You're pulling my leg, mate. Are you messing? So do you know who you can have, mate? Kieran Slicker. Your good friend, Kieran Slicker, mate. What a man. Slap him in at centre mid, please. He's going to put on a clinic once again. You'll be sorry. You're going to rue the day. 
One goalkeeper apiece then, Jack. Mm-hmm. Before we both get at least one more goalie in our squad, we need to do the fullbacks slash left mid or right mid. Indeed. I'm going to go first. Okay. And again, I've got some logic with my guesses. Apparently, my logic for Ruben Neves was pretty bloody stupid. So, hopefully this one works out okay. You're probably thinking, I need an icon to get my Ronaldo and Neves onto full chem. If I make it a Portuguese icon, it basically gets everyone onto full chem and I just need one more Portuguese player. There's a few different ways I could go about this team, basically. But did you remember, Jack, about fire and ice cards? and how a F FC versus fire gives crap loads of chemistry to their nation. So I'll have Jao Felix, and that's full chem for my Portuguese players. Okay. And on the other side, I've, I've got a player. We started with a chem breaker, and he's a chem breaker from La Liga. And I've already picked any La Liga players. I just built a full bloody nation team around them. So let's head over to La Liga, and let's use our special position change to get ourselves a little bit of Marcus Lorente. Interesting, mate. Interesting. I did not think you were going to put Jao Felix at left mid. I did not think you were going to put Marcus Lorente at right mid. Um, I thought you were going to go for Acuna and Lamela, mate. Um, using the La Liga, get Ooh, a okay. good defensive player at left mid. Obviously, Lamela is just a, a half-decent player with a perfect link. So, you can have them, mate. Unfortunately for me, I like it. Very More nice. coins for me to discard as well. That Chow Felix is not cheap. I didn't think of that, actually. <laughs> How much is he? I don't know. He's quite expensive. He's like... At least. Okay, oh my god, you, you give me a nearly give me a heart attack down, Jack. He's off a mil. I mean that's expensive. Yeah, that's right. The way you were saying it, I thought it was gonna be like the stupid prices of these FC players. Uh, no, 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 the no, fantasy no, no. players. No. Ooh. Okay, that was a mini heart attack. Do you know what I might do actually? I might move Ronaldo to the opposite side. Does he, oh he has aerial. Oh Jack, you're in trouble, mate. Whipped pass plus Marcus Lorente, crossing it back sticks to Cristiano. Brilliant. <clears throat> Sublime. Who would you like? Well, mate, I would like at left back the player I actually guessed for you. I want a Cunha. Ooh. And then at right back, I'm either going to go for. Pretty sure for Sevilla, there's. I think there's Monty. Oh, no, Monty is not there anymore. Jesus Navas is a shout, though. That's not a bad chat at all. But I was also looking at a bit of Molina. I believe he has a card, doesn't he? He still gets two chemistry. I feel like a club link might be better for me in this instance. I don't know if, though, the Jesus Navas is available to buy on the market. So that's going to potentially disrupt my decision. So I'm just going to double check. And yet, yeah, he is an objective. So I'm going to go for... Molina, mate. And Double whipped pass plus, Jack. Yeah, you're in trouble, bro. Crossing the ball into Bruce. <laughs> it's going to love it. <laughs> you, my friend, can have them both. I thought, I'm building a little Portuguese team. You're building a Premier League team, basically. Yeah. So I put Emerson and Rico Lewis. Oh, I thought you might have gone new doggy or something. Werner does need chem, doesn't he? Yeah. Need a little bit of chem. Little bit a little bit. I think one more, one more prem player. Just a does, little, little bit of chem. Mm. Right, interesting, Jack. Very interesting. Mm. Nice. Very, team, very interesting. Very interesting. Very. I'm not going to say very interesting again. I'm going to say let's move on because I've got nothing else to say. All right, Jack. The final stage. It's been a lot of deliberating for myself here of how to get full chemistry. Yep. And I was really trying to do it super sneakily. I need someone from La Liga who's Spanish or from Atletico. So then I was thinking, what if I got somebody not from a Liga who's Spanish and then a random La Liga player who isn't either of them things and you won't have been able to write it down. And I got it, but I don't have one of the cards I need in order to do it. Pau Torres, Diego Carlos, Militao, that works. Don't have the Diego Carlos, and put Martinez in goal. Instead... I'm pretty sure that works anyway. Anyway, it doesn't matter. I can't do it. I haven't got the yoga course. What I'm going to do, Jack, is I'm just going to get a Spanish player from La Liga. I'm going to risk it in goal. 
And I'm going to go for the highest rated one, Alex Romero. Either genius or insanely stupid. In front of him, I'm going to go for a full league earned defense. I'll grab a perfect link with Hernandez and Kim Pembe. And then to get chemistry, I'll have Thiago Jello because he's Portuguese. Well, 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 Andy, 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 what have you done once again, my friend? What have you done? You avoided the Spanish player, mate. Oh, I put down Cabello. I think he's a winter wild card. Half decent card. There's no way you've guessed one of them other ones. Then I put down three players from another league, mate. The first one being Hernandez. You're winding me up. The second one. You are winding me up, Jack. The second one being Kalulu, and the third one being my nan. So I might have guessed Hernandez, but unfortunately it was the wrong one. It was one. the wrong one. <laughs> I could have just been a bit, no, but oh, obviously wait, with, with the other guesses. Is position change, that Hernandez? Or does he have a centre-back one as well? He's got a centre-back card now, yeah. Oh my God. I, knew, I, knew, I just chose Serie A because it was the quickest kind of like first thought perfect link thing that I could do you know what I mean could have been any of them though oh, 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 oh. <laughs> jammy jammy man that was scary did you put an apostrophe like a first name and then an apostrophe no literally or just adopt. Hernandez no. but I'm being you honest you could have been a snake yeah but with, with like Kalulu and my nan it's pretty obvious it's I'm guessing obvious, it? yeah, 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 you would have so. got crucified <laughs> yeah it would have actually been quite funny if I'd just gone with that though <laughs> and then you'd only realised when it comes to editing it <laughs> right who would you like, Jack? My defense then. I've got this all worked out, all right? We are gonna go for Bayer. Bayer? In progress, future stars, evolution, German center back for Burnley. 81 pace, 82 defending, 82 physical. Not bad card, mate. By in me. progress, you mean it haven't started? Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and never will. Um, then. <laughs> We have got <laughs> Baddy at right centre back. And then in goal, we're going to go for Nick Pope. I had a smittering of hope that you're going to pick the goal they wrote down. Then when you pick Baddy, is I put Ariola? Oh my god. I changed from Ariola to Pope. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> I put Mavropanos for the link to Areola, and I put Jimenez. You just needed two Premier League players to get Werner Fulkem, so I thought you'd just pick a club link. Yeah. Yeah. And you've gone from Burnley. When people ask me if I like football, I say yes. Except Burnley. <laughs> Burnley can get into the game. Best dribbler you've seen on this game, didn't you say, Jack? He does seem quite good, to be fair. I know I've just lost the ball. That was pretty mad. I won the ball Play there. on ref. Play on ref. Oh, God. Cristo oh Ronaldo! My oh, my God. God. The leap from that, lad. I forgot you had Ronaldo. <laughs> Come on, This card, I hate. Oh, look, the way is... Anna oh, my God. Oh, oh no! my God! Oh my Mate, god. The way that team of Werner does animations, there's just something wrong with him. Two! Oh, oh my, my god. god. He thinks he's taking a free kick. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? Ow. Mate, Kieran Slicker what? wins tackles, mate. You're Kieran Slicker me. wins tackles, Jack. Oh my god, has Ramirez lost? Oh. So, what oh my a save. god, how's he not scored? Flip it now. It's filth! Go! Oh, go! You're bannering oh, me. That's such a terrible goal. You're bannering me. <laughs> so bad. Right, this fan is a problem, you know. Oh my oh, god. Thankfully, it's still Team Averna. What the yes. hell? Go! Go, Palo Futre!
I can't believe that's happened. Where is my defence as well? Would somebody like to tell me where the hell my defence went? I mean, that was pretty cold, to be fair. You just got ball roll scoop turned green times. That was you, oh, where are you, where are you going paid, mate? That's oh, Pruse. Oh my days, are you bantering me? <laughs> no, stop, stop, stop. What a tackle. That's a great tackle. That's poor. Honestly, couldn't have timed that better. Yeah. Referee. Sweet. Oh, man. Not having a flipping thingy does you up, doesn't it? I wish I had a flipping thingy as well, to be fair. Oh, what a ball. Surely not Jack scoring for himself. Oh, <gasps> my God. <sighs> <laughs> Every time he gets the ball, it's so broken. <laughs> 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 not that, not that broken, not Jack. That broken. <laughs> Cristiano Ronaldo, you, my friend, have dropped an absolute stinker in this game. Mate, Ramirez is passing. Jesus okay. Christ. We'll take wait, wait, it. Did you just slander Ramirez's passing when he just did that? No, I said it was I said Ramirez's pass like, as in like Oh, it's unbelievably good. I've not used many players like that that can ping a ball like he does. I can't believe he's got the shot off and it's gone in there. Oh, bloody Paolo fruit tray. We'll and take that's the end of the game. Less discards. I mean, yeah. <sighs> that was tough with no striker. That wasn't tough with Kieran Slicker because he's absolutely class. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. I tell you, it was tough with Cristiano Ronaldo. That absolute clown missed so many sitters. May as well have had a bronze mate of him up top. And I am what you call ready. 4 3 3 second. Let's go. CDM. <laughs> You got me. Oh, for <laughs> Christ's sake. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> oh, we love it. We absolutely love it. Goodbye.